And welcome back. Every Tuesday, you know, you can find the Sioux Falls Dot Business Report right here on Dakota News Now. Our friend Jody Schwann in studio once again with us today. Always good to see you. Thanks, you too. A new development on the market, Southern Edge of Sioux Falls, getting a whole lot of attention. What do you know about this? This is an exciting one, uh, at least maybe down the road, Brian. Keep an eye on this intersection in South Central Sioux Falls. I think some big development could be ahead here. We are talking about this new one called Academy Park. It is a 75 acre development on the southwest corner of 85th and Cliff. There it is. So this is adjacent to the new 70 acre Harrisburg School District's Freshman Academy and we think the future second high school. So the concept for Academy Park calls for a mix of commercial uses, including what we call big box retail. So these are some of those large, sometimes as national retailers, sometimes they're grocery stores, but they need a lot of space and this could be a site for it. And the appeal of this area, much like we saw at nearby 85th in Minnesota, where of course we also had those national retailers locating, a growing amount of traffic because of it, and then you add in the new school and they really think that this could be appealing. Of course, things like this take time. Hope is to have some of those initial, what we call the anchor deals secured in the next couple of years. Could be three to five years though, before you actually see dirt moving there. The amount of traffic moving at 85th and Cliff right now is amazing. It's only going to increase, yeah. yes. All right, from Southern Sioux Falls to the heart of the city, the owner of the former Joe Foss School Building, breathing some new life into that historic space. This sounds exciting. I really like this one, Brian. You know, those of you who are longtime Sioux Falls residents, you'll appreciate what's being done, I think, to the former Joe Foss School. The idea here is to turn it into a marketplace. They're calling this Global Square, and the idea is because ultimately they'd really like to see some international flair here. But for now, it's a lot of unique local businesses, big range of uses. Building, of course, is in the Whittier neighborhood over there on North Cliff. Uh, inside, you're going to find everyone from South Dakota Aerial Arts, which is repurposing part of the gym, as you can see, um, to smaller clothing and music businesses. They've got a photography studio. They even have a small church in there. Mm. Uh, all small spaces, so nothing larger than 2,000 square feet. Nice fit for a newer or a local business looking to get started and maybe draw up some of that other activity in the building. Incidentally, the owner understands uh, this whole international angle very well. He's from Afghanistan. He moved here 12 years ago wow. and he said he didn't want to see this building turned into apartments. He wanted to see a greater variety of shops and offer opportunities for diverse entrepreneurs. So great little story there. How exciting and unique is mm -hmm, that? For sure. Jody Schwann with Sioux Falls Dot Business. Thank you for coming in as always. Absolutely. You bet a reminder, you can stay up to date with the very latest local business headlines by heading over to Sioux Falls Dot Business. And we will be right back.